Hey there, guys! It is I, Mr. Skids, and welcome back to The Wolf Among Us. Now, if you remember last time, I was going to kill a motherfucker. I was going to kill this Georgie fellow. I think I'm just going to rip him to shreds. Maybe, maybe just delim him first. I don't know. I just don't like this motherfucker and I feel like he should die. Many, 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 many deaths. So let's continue, shall we? Let us continue. I'll probably have to... Oh, well, yep, that's a thing. So here we go. Sorry, I had to skip through the entire beginning part again. So, but, 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 but we're back where we started from. And I probably, I'll probably have to... Do some censoring here. How many times do I have to say it? I can't talk to that You're guy. Supposed to turn the clients on. Can I? That's your job. Uh, uh, you want them to feel happy. I'm gonna make you, you feel make you real happy. happy. Oh fuck! You uh, want them to forget about your shoulders and those fucking narrow hips. You want them to get so worked up that they'll stuff their wallets. I'm gonna fucking kill ya. Hey there, friend. Oh, it's you. We're closed. Oh god, I'm gonna have to keep dancing you. I didn't say stop. More censoring! Wee more censoring. For fuck's sake. You stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. We're not finished. You Georgie. Brilliant deduction, Sheriff. You're gonna die. Shit faced, fuckhead, cocksucking son of what a bitch. What do you want then? You here for a little taste? I'm gonna break your neck. Tell you what, come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Ooh, I'm gonna kill him. Or, uh, knowing you, she's probably mm. not quite your style. Mm. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target or one that will put up a fight? You don't know me. Yeah. You don't know me. Okay, mysterious lone wolf, right, I got you. Jesus, Big B, you're so corny. I love it though. No, seriously, I love it. <laughs> you do? You do now, huh? You love it. Because uh, I know a few other things I'm gonna love okay, to do with all you. Right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Kill him. Look, Kill him I now. Know why you're here. Then what? When did you hear? Do you know? Are you sure? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamoured. Of course she was, you daft git. She was a troll. No. I mean glamoured to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. It's their own business. I think you're behind this. You got her a black market glamour as part of some twisted sex fantasy. Ooh, black market, is it? How exciting. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Stole me. You're the go thug. Around a bunch of accusations. Try to scare people. But you've got fuck all to back it up. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. He used to be something, you know. Nothing to back it up? Well, what the fuck is this then? Get that out of my face. I found it on Lily's body, and it's definitely a back alley job. Where did she get it? You've got this all wrong. If Lily was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. For fuck's sake, I want that kind of eat. Who was she doing it for, then? She had clients, Bigby. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. Like who? Try looking in the mirror. <laughs> you funny. Anyway, now what to do with me? Funny friend. Go on then. Do you want to lose a few of those goddamn tattoos? We're not done here. We're not done here. I think we are. I said we're not. You're gonna hit me? Go ahead. That's what you want to do, right? That's what you came here for, right? That's what you like. Fuck you. 
Fuck you. Oh, no. Fuck. Fuck you, Georgie. Yo, take your sad fucking face where I can't see it. Fuck you. Bloody bastard fucking shit. You deserve it. You're a piece of shit. You proud of yourself, mate. Proud of your little mess. Yes, I am. You deserve it. I'm fucking Fuck. pissed. I hate this cocksucker. I hate this motherfucker. Fuck off, Hans. Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not gonna know anything about the girls and their clients or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know, including me. I cover my eyes and take my cut. End of story. Why not look it up? What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written in You're it? You're a fucking moron. Show me. There is no book. And as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication skills and have a fairly good idea where to start. Don't you even hey, dare. that's my personal property. I'm gonna hit fucking Brit. <laughs> sure, go ahead. Do what comes naturally. I had, a, I had a good punch. I had a good punch. I feel much better now that I, knock, I knocked him in the fucking head. But. Tell me about the book. You haven't got the slightest clue about anything. I don't, but I want to know. Oh. Hey, now. I'm not going to break all your shit. I had a good punch. I think you deserve a lot Not more, crap, but... Georgie. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. Again. Really, now? Don't even think about it. Just tell me where it is. And I won't destroy everything Look, in your George, fucking place. Why don't you just tell me where the book is? Can we please not go round and round about this? There's no book. Sure, End sure, there's no book. There is no book. There is no book. Do not touch that. You hear me? That's nothing to do with you. Well then, you're still. There's still time for you to just cough just it up. Just give it up, so or I'll sorry, beat you no more. There's no magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off me back. Oh, what's this then, huh, sir? What's in the safe? Well, well, what's this? Looks like a floor safe. Uh, I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Sh sure. Sheriff, will you come on? Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. Give me the book, Georgie. This is your last goddamn warning. Otherwise, you get hurt. Give it to me. You're a big bad bastard. We get it. Everyone's guilty. We fucking get it. Not everyone's guilty, but you Jesus. are a piece of trash. You're killing me. I'm begging you. I'll pay you. People are dead. You piece of you shit. women are dead. Then quit being a bloody idiot. Then tell me. Tell me Come where the fucking it. book. Leave it. There's nothing there for you. You might want to stand back. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, you're lucky. I didn't really want to do it, but fuck it. This bastard was way, way too much an asshole. Bloody come on, then. You're lucky your place ain't fucking wrecked. Once again, don't get your hopes up. There's nothing in here that'll tell you anything. But it's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so we can be happy about that. Good. I don't care about your fucking club, and I don't care about you. I could fucking wipe the floor with your fucking dumbass head. Here. This is Lily's last entry. So tell me, Georgie. Who's this Mr. Smith? Oh, dear. I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Big You B. think? Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Ants knows that. 207. What's 207? Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book. Your girl's. You're not their fucking secretary. Ooh. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear oh, on somebody. something. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. The girls. They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths and Joneses and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. 
I log the business, take my cut, and I'm out. You're the fucker now, that keeps him I've under your thumb. I've got enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. You're just lucky you didn't get you didn't end up with worse, you fucking halfwit. You Hello, business office. What, what, what? Um, okay, he just kind of that vanished. All right, that's cool. Oh, good. Finger. Good, the finger. What else did you have in here, by the way? Yeah, that's right. Small stack of bills. 58. Hmm. Mine. Fuck you, that's my money. That's fucking my money. Take the money. Fuck you! That was the 58 I gave fucking faith! Asshole. Fuck you, I am not- I wanna talk to the deputy mayor. Back out. I won't take all of your goddamn money. Just ba take back what is mine. So you are the fucking scumbag that- I don't give a rat's ass about that. Just fuck off and fetch him for me, alright? You're lucky I didn't kill you. You're just fucking lucky I didn't break your legs. Just remember that, Georgie. No, I don't want to. Remember, I didn't wreck your fucking place. And remember, you only left here with a fucking black eye. Fucking piece of shit. Fine. I'm oh, on. man, he is the type of scumbag that I would just want to fucking use as a punching bag. But I am disciplined, and I got away with one punch, and that's it. I don't want to make him... Too angry, just in case I need his help later, but I needed to really smash his face at least once. Faith's jewelry Watch box. Been busted open. Huh. Well, I bet that was the Tweedles. Oh, yep, that's the Tweedles. Can open, but there isn't even a lock. The Tweedles. The Tweedles had something to do with this. Lipstick, lip gloss, compact, glitter. Hmm. Faith. Oh, the money is the... Uh, okay. Why am I still holding the money, by the way? Why is that still in my hands? <laughs> um, I don't think that's supposed to be there. Oh, uh oh. Okay. Um, I, I think the game's having a bit of a fucking moment. I think you're at the game sticking. Thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. <laughs> Lily. Oh. Looks like they both saw one of Lily's clients. So. Uh. Hmm. So that means Lily. Maybe. I think Faith was killed for another reason. There was definitely a reason behind it. And Faith told Lily something that got both of them killed, I think. Excuse me. Hello. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. I keep hearing that. Somebody else said that to me on the way in. I guess we're all surprised. There's that lost cat again on the wall. That person really wants their cat back. You're trying to place me. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Oh. Once upon a time. Does that help? You have legs. Kind of glamour. <laughs> Why? Why, you Little Mermaid? Why? No, they're real. Do you like them? They cost me a lot. Oh. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Uh, of course you do. I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. Does the number 207 mean anything to you? Oh, I assumed it was a room number, but where? We can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean, can't. What? These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. People Assassins keep saying that. Here by design. 
People keep saying People that. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I, I need to know this. about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips. Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? Is some. Uh, what are you suggesting? I think I understand. She's. Okay. I understand. It... What would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. All I got is the 53. I don't have it. I don't have it. I don't have it. I only have the 150. Or not 100. I have only Wait here for 80, a second. 58. I only have 58. $2,000 for that goddamn cat, by the way. Oh, man. Oh, man. Man. God damn it, man. Now I'm holding money and the key. Not 207. You'll think of something. The open arms. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. Uh -huh. I hope you find what you're looking for. Thank you. Thank you, Nerissa. Or the mermaid or whatever you want to be called right now. Thank you. This helps... A lot. I'm gonna fucking shut this place down when I get a chance. Fuck you, Georgie. Hello. Oh. Um, okay. That, that's the hotel right there. I don't know what that was all about, but... Okay. I can understand what's going on, sorta, kinda. That bus was awfully loud. That was loud in my ear holes. But I guess that would be a thing in New York City. Open Arms Hotel. So what do we got here, my friends? Anything good? Anything cluey? Maybe I need Blue's clues to help me out here. Help me out, Blue. I need your fucking help more than ever. When I was a child, I used to watch that cartoon. Now I need you. Yeah. She'll kill you. <laughs> Bigsby. I th I, the only person dying is me, and it's from you, Bigsby. So that's the only person dying here. You're killing me. Look at the phone. Anything interesting? Uh, I should probably repair that. You think? That would kind. That kind of is uh, needed to be able to telephone peoples all the peoples I could just go up the door but let's see if the door be the bell works hello want it by the hour or for the whole night is that beauty, uh, beauty. I work here okay I work the front desk it's to help pay rent so now you know I know I should have told somebody but Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beast is a proud man, Bigby. He wants to do right by me, and he, he just couldn't handle it if he knew I had to do this so we don't get evicted. All of our friends live at the Woodlands. He'd be mortified. Well, your secret's safe with me, all right? Let's not make a big thing of it. Thanks, I'm Bigby. Sorry. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. So, what are you doing here? Beast is already working oh, multiple jobs. you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh. Oh, yes. The, the troll. I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. As trolls do, I guess. You know Tweedledee? Have you ever seen Lily with anyone? Have you seen Snow here? Did you know Tweedledee? Do you I talked to Tweedledee. Yeah, I want to know more about that. He mentioned you in passing. Do you know him or his brother? I 
took out a loan for back pay. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money, plus interest. Why take out a loan from those two? It was from the crooked man. Beauty. You don't know how desperate I was, Bigby. I had nowhere else to go. Look, if this ever happens again, come see me or Snow first, all right? I tried. Oh. I'm so sorry, Beauty. I'm so damn sorry. These, this is so fucked up. It's so fucked up. The whole system is fucked. And we need to get rid of Crane because he's the one behind this all. Ever see Lily with someone here? Maybe on a job? Sometimes, but nobody I've recognized. I haven't worked here that long, though. How about a room register? Or someone named Mr. Smith? <laughs> That's all we get here. Smiths, Jones, or Johnsons. I think the last ones are jokes. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Probably. Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's, it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather... Sorry. It's okay, beauty. Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me, even though she knew that I saw her. I just assumed it wasn't Snow and went about my business. Okay, okay. Thanks. Wait. It'll be better if anyone sees you that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Double hour. Five minutes, please. We'll see, beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. Okay, okay. Uh, we learned so much just in a few seconds. Listen, Bigby. I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something, which is fine. It's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. Uh... Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just, well, you never know. Oh, those background sounds. Need a lie. Not lie, just not include my name. Just say you talk to the clerk or something. Uh... You'll do what you have to. I just want you to know that that would help me. Uh... Well, here we are. I guess... Which one was it? 207? Uh... We need to get into 207. We need to get into 207. I... I don't really want to look in any of the others, really, right now. It might not be the best choice. Okay, let us, uh, listen. Anything in going on in there? 207. We gotta get in this room. Knock. Anybody inside? Knock, knock. Who's there? Dandruff. Dandruff who? Dandruff. I didn't have... Damn, I didn't have a better drift. I don't know. I, I was thinking, trying to think of a joke. I'm sorry. Open the door. Open the door. Get on the floor. Get on the floor and open that door. Yes. Double time. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Uh, Not to this one. Yeah. Hold on, Big B. I can't just let you go into any room you want. I know. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. You have to let me in there. This is this is the room, 207. But I... This is the room Lily was in. Oh, fine. I'm sorry, Beauty. I know this could get you in trouble, but I need to investigate it. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, oh, shit. Beast? Beast, what are you doing here? How could you do this to me? Oh, no. No, sweetie, no. Wait a minute. How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I took care of you. I love- It's not what you think. Please. You're cheating on me? With him? No, no, Beast. I promise I'm not. Sorry about that. My dog started going a little crazy, and I was like- I had to wait a minute, see if I could calm her down a bit. I'm sorry about that, guys, but I'm back now, so we should have a grand old time with what's going on right now. Ooh, this is gonna be good. I'm helping him. That's all. 
I'll bet. Oh, beast. I'm sure you help each other just great. All right, I know you got it wrong. Places. I know what goes on no, here. That's not what I meant. It's a, I'm on a case. A murder investigation. She's helping me. Stop lying to me. Uh, beast, listen. What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife. Beast, listen to me. There's nothing going on. I'm mad. Ah! Beast. Hey. Bastard. I guess I finally see you for who you are. Stop. Stop it. Beast, you stop. You told me you had seen her, you fucking liar. Don't you do this. Sleeping with her this whole time. Listen to your wife. Just calm down. And Beast. Please calm down, Beast. Ah! No, 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 no! Ah, damn it! My hand was off the keyboard. I should have seen that one coming. What do you think you're doing? Okay. You aren't even listening to me! Oh, up W. There we go. We got you this time. I'm on the case. I saw a boost. Okay. Okay, I picked it. I didn't know if I was picking a direction, but I guess I picked it. Ah, Beast, I'm sorry. I don't want to kick your ass. I really don't. Leave him be. I this want him. Fault. I want him to leave him be, but he's so he's pissed. Oh, I gotta dodge. I, I did it. I pressed up B or up W. I, I don't know why is it not working. Uh, get off! Get off! Get off! Oh God! His eyes! Ow! 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 Oh, his eyes! Ah! Beast! Beast! Stop this! He's had enough. I don't want to hurt Beast anymore. I didn't. Beast, no. Beast, no. I stopped from hitting you, Beast. Beast, I didn't want to hurt you. I don't want to hurt you over this. You ruined everything. I nothing is. She's my fucking wife. I'm. Oh God. Beast, why? <sighs> done what big b look what you did to the door you can't just act like this whenever Stand you back you you don't want to see this oh my god Do doors open now i guess well, we got the door open <gasps> oh my god don't touch anything is this is this lily met her client here mr smith whoever he is and then must have happened right here. Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work the front desk. I... Anyone? So that's... Yeah. Still, this is no place for someone like you. I mean, look. Can we please not talk about this? Who rented... Do you remember who rented this room last night? I don't think anyone did. Not last night. Maybe they have it long term. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? I'm sorry, it Beauty. Seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? I'm sorry, Beast. Oh, I'm so sorry, Beast. You deserve so much better. You two deserve better. Big B. What kind of a person could do something like this? Fuck me, look That's at exactly it. exactly what I'm about to try to find so out. Much blood. Oh, fuck. It's... Oh, God, why? I can't believe this. Hold on, let me check the cassette player. What were they listening to, even? Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Okay, is there anything in the cassette player? No, 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 uh... uh Okay, um, uh, it has, for some odd reason, it's flashing 12, so it doesn't have the actual time on there, so somebody made sure it didn't, I guess. I'm not sure. A storybook? What is Snow that? White. It's a book about Snow White, or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. Um, I can't read any of that, so, Fuji the read- The book is about her? Yeah. I can't read that. Fuji, Red, Del Red Delicious Empire. Why are they asking about the a the apple? Was she breathing? Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a 
deep sleep, but they think she's dead. Right, right. That makes no sense. Okay, then. I don't, I don't know. What, what's that all about? Why are they trying to discover the history of, of... It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. So apparently, okay, we, that's a little clue. That's a little clue. Wine. Classy. Wine. Would that look like a very... This, we shouldn't even be in here. That looks like a very similar wine. Oh, it's a set. For my arrival. Oh, boy. What could be on this goddamn cassette? I don't like where this is going at all. I don't like this at all. The flowers. Somebody was really. S Somebody wanted to be Snow White's Prince Charming. Bigby, this? I think I heard this music last night. It was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here, and I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Could have covered up the sound of the murder. <sighs> Somebody was playing the Prince Charming to fucking Snow White. Fucking somebody really fucking sick. Is there anything else you can tell me about last night? Anything that sticks out in your mind? Sorry, no, it just seemed like every other night does. That's exactly what's bothering me. From now on, I'll just be down there imagining this. <sighs> Sorry, beauty. Damn it, you deserve better. How can I find out who rented this room? Find whoever has the key? I'm pretty sure this one must be held long term. And we don't keep a register or anything. This place is intentionally kind of anonymous. Right. I keep hearing that. Yep. I'm not gonna blame her for fucking squat all. She does... She's not a part of this. I can tell. I can just tell. Oh! It's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no. She must have been wearing it. He killed her and then... And then he took it back off? No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other time. Oh, God. What is it? It looks... It, uh, he likes it rough. Looks like... This is the same dress as the one yeah. in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. Why? I guess he wanted to get the details right. God, role-playing as a person who really exists, who we know, that's just weird. I'm not sure who to feel worse for. Okay, no, I take that back. Uh, good. Good, taking, taking it back. God. God. Yes, God is right. God damn it is more like it. Is there nothing else? Okay, the bed, the bed. Yeah, she was holding these lilies in her hand when she died. Yep. Where'd you get that? Lily had it in her hand. Yep. In case there was any doubt over who died here. Yeah. Hmm. What? What are you thinking? Snow's coffin looks like a ritual sacrifice. Flowers mean a personal connection. It reminds Maybe. me of... It Sorry. It looks like Snow's coffin from the book. He's reenacted the scene with her lying here, surrounded by flowers. Mr. Smith put Lily to rest here. You're right. It fits. He's acting out scenes from the book. That poor girl. She didn't deserve this. Nobody she deserved this. Known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. How did she wind up here? I mean, not exactly here, but just how does a person... Georgie took advantage of her when she was in trouble. He's a real predator. He's a scumbag. Yeah, 
I would fucking. This is why I wanted to break him in she half. Must have been so scared. What's this? An apple. Do you smell something? No, just apple. Huh. Oh no, there's more. What? What now? It was eating. He's got a single bite taken out of it, like in Snow's story. Yep. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course. That makes perfect sense. He's just acting out another part of the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in a Snow White dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book. That's the creepy as hell. And the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. Thanks. <laughs> so he planned it all out. He had all the details noted down. Only then, when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up. Yeah. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. Um, I am. Um, I don't want to stay here any longer either. Oh, hey! More clues. Gimme. Give Gimme give the note. The music suddenly just fucking jumped. Whatever. Oh. Are those pictures of the dead girl? No, those are real Snow White. Not all of them. How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no. Bigby. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. <sighs> that was the mirror. Somebody's watching us right now. Next step closer. What is it? It's <gasps> Crane. Fuck. Oh, you dirty motherfucker. No! Oh! Crane. No respect for the dead. That was it? That was it could be after you now. Oh. Um. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting weasel. Fucking crane. Really starting to like you, Sheriff. You're not afraid to be a complete bastard. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. No, get the fuck out of here, Bluebeard. Hello, Big B. Oh boy. Take care of it, Big B, or I'll take care of it for you. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? Uh. The music kind of ended, but how did you respond to Crane about Snow's death? Uh, you and 69.9% .9 of players sympathized with him, but oh, there was a whole nother reason why he wanted this. Oh, God. How did you treat the murder suspect? You and 62% of players persuaded him to talk. Did you let Snow come to the, with you to the trip trap? 91% of you did. Uh, how did you handle Georgie? Only 30% of players hit Georgie. So I was the only one of the only people that actually punched him in the head, which he deserved. Did you keep punching Beast when he was down? 77.8% of players opted to not hit Beast. So, yeah, pretty good. Okay. Music's awfully loud. But that was it. That was episode two of The Wolf Among Us. So I hopefully... I hopefully, uh, fuck. I hope you guys have been enjoying this video. I hope you're enjoying this series as much as I am. I've said this before, but I, god damn this mystery. God damn Crane. Fucking Crane, man. He's, oh, fuck. And Georgie and Crane, and now I gotta, 
Now I'm gonna have to deal with Georgie again. At least I didn't smash his place up. I just fucking punched him upside the head. I know I'm gonna have to deal with him again because of this. I'm gonna have to... Crane... Killed... At, maybe killed Lily? Uh, Crane killed Lily. I'm pretty sure we got, gotta get Crane? But what if Crane did isn't the killer? Because there's supposed to be a season 2 coming out at some point. So maybe Crane isn't the killer? Because the story keeps going on unless we're actually chasing Crane down. Because he's got... Um... He's got... He's gone to like somewhere else. Like maybe... Oh hey! Oh I think that's Colin's human form. Maybe. I'm not sure. Is that Bigfoot by the way in there? Bullshit. There's a... Is there clues in this going on in this background that I had no idea about? Might be. Certification of Seer Security. Bigby Wolf. Certification of Distinction. So he actually has certificates in this sort of field. Okay. Alright. Um. So yeah. That. We're gonna have to chase fucking Crane down. He destroyed the goddamn mirror. Now we can't figure out where he is. And we're... F Fucker! He killed the mirror. Oh, I'm, oh my god, I fucking... We might be able to fix it with magic, but I'm not sure. We're gonna have to take a look in the next episode, so... Yeah, I guess that's it for part five. I will see you all in... Part six? Hopefully, we shall see now. Is there anything else? Nope, nothing else. Okay, so I will hopefully see you all got in part six. See you guys. Bye!